Hi, my magical creatures, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is um, that we're gonna talk about like the different clairs, like the psychic gifts and everything like that. So before we begin, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, a like, and don't forget to subscribe. It's a free way to help your girl out. All right, let's get started. Okay, um, so the three, so there's different clairs, uh, like clairvoyance, clairaudience, clairsentience, all them gifts. So basically, um, I'm going to talk about like my experiences with each one. Um, and also too, like you also have gifts too, um, that are the different clairs. So, um, the first one I'm going to talk about is clairvoyance. That is my gift that I have. Uh, I'm really good at that gift. So what clairvoyance is, is basically um, seeing pictures or seeing visions. Um, it has to do with the third eye. That gift is linked with the third eye. So when it's open, you can see like spirits, uh, see the, the future, the past, present. Um, you can also see um, a lot of things reside in the in the third eye but um clairvoyance for me i definitely saw visions of the future and stuff like nothing worldwide but just like little things in my life like uh people i have visions of people that um i ended up meeting later that day um and they were wearing these same exact clothes when i saw them in my vision um i used uh well i still kind of see them but i used to really see them like pit like perfect as day like spirits and ghosts and stuff like that um, and then also too, I would see like animals too in spirit form. Um, yeah. And also too, um, what else? My clairvoyant gifts. Um, but yeah, like seeing stuff, astral projection, having really vivid dreams, um, you know, stuff like that. So that's kind of like clairvoyance, um, in a nutshell for that. Um, so the next one we're going to talk about is clear audience. So clear audience resides in the throat chakra. So that's like hearing spirits, hearing angels, getting messages. Um, I can hear angels perfectly fine. Um, also too, that's kind of like a mediumship gift, you know. Also Joan of Arc um, also said that she can hear them too. So she was definitely, definitely clear audience. Um, so for me, it's just kind of like... Um, a voice it's kind of like a like you hear it's like a thought in your head but you can hear them and stuff like that and for a long time I was like I hope to god this isn't schizophrenia so I talked to my psych professor and she said what schizophrenia is is like when you hear negative voices in your head and stuff like that but these voices were always positive and I asked her too I was like is it possible that people who are schizophrenic can hear positive things and she said um that's a good question but no I've never heard of anything like that so that's how I knew in my head it was not um not schizophrenia and I've seen Archangel Michael appear when I would talk to him with my clear audience gifts and I would see him appear physically in front of me so that was another uh way I knew like okay I do not have schizophrenia like I'm really talking to interdimensional beings so um yeah um so, also, too, um, kind of, like, in the beginning, too, like, I would hear, like, little, like, um, like, when you're driving and stuff like that, and if you're lost or something, uh, you may hear, like, a quick, like, turn right, and then you're, like, oh, okay, like, why, why am I thinking turning right, and then they turn right, you know, and then that's, like, the right way to go, so usually that's, like, um, signs of clear audience coming and stuff like that. Um, like signs of that your um, clairvoyant site is opening to is like you usually see like little shadows and stuff darting in the corner of your eye and stuff like that. That's usually signs that your third eye is open and that you have clairvoyant gifts and stuff. Um, so the next clair that we're going to talk about is uh, clairsentience and that resides in the heart chakra. So my experiences with that, clairsentience branches off into like empathy and empathing and stuff like that so when you're reading people and stuff like that I'll get like a sensation of like hugging or all right well my camera had cut off um but back to what I was saying about the clairsentient gift is that it resides in the heart chakra and basically it's like it branches off into like gifts like em empathy like uh, empathing and uh, feeling people's emotions um, stuff like that and um, I felt um, 
with this gift, it's like a blessing and a curse because um, I'll be around people and stuff and I would literally like this guy, I remember I would talk to, I remember it was my first day at work and I met this guy and immediately I felt this like, I want her, like um, she's beautiful. Like I felt like this desire, like I want her, like type of desire and I was like, I was like, why, why did I feel that? And then later on, like within that week, he told me like, I think you're really pretty. Like, can I take you out? You know, stuff like that. And I was like, oh my God. So that was kind of like, that was my empathing skills right there. When I first met him, I immediately felt the impression. I felt this feeling. But one thing about it though, that is kind of hard is like, sometimes you don't know, like, um, sometimes you think it's your, your stuff, but really it's, you're picking up on their stuff, you know, and you're taking it as your own, you know, so you have to like learn how to decipher like when you're picking up on people's stuff and when you're not. Um, also too, like, um, with empathing and everything, um, you have to be careful because sometimes you can do like, uh, like you can be completely drained, like going into crowds and stuff. Like when I go to the mall, I have to make sure I use like energy protection and bringing a white light and putting shields up and stuff like that. Cause definitely, um, people people are really attracted to empaths and stuff and empathic people tend to attract nar uh, narcissistic people and stuff like that so um definitely be watchful of that be watchful of who you surround and who you have people are around you because their energy can definitely can drain you and stuff like that um especially if you're around like negative people and stuff like that um so definitely these are the three there are many other Claire gifts too um but today we're just gonna talk about the don't the top three so um definitely if you have any questions or if you want to know what type of psychic gifts that you have I can definitely read uh tune in and read um stuff like that so if you want to book a uh, reading with me uh my website is down in the link below and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay magical.